Oil kicked off the new week with gains. Over the past year, oil prices have advanced fourfold. Against this background, the current value seems to be relatively low. However, the quotes are unlikely to drop in the near future. This has a profound effect on other markets, in particular on the ruble's dynamics as well as on demand for precious metals. Watch our video to learn more about the market situation and forecasts from analysts. According to the chart, Brent crude oil has gained significantly since the early trade. Currently, the European benchmark is trading at $84.5 per barrel. Earlier, analysts predicted a strong rise in oil prices, which could open the way to a new target, namely $85 a barrel. Now everything is going exactly as planned. When the quote achieves this level, it will be possible to predict its further direction. Meanwhile, a steep surge in inflation in the euro area has an impact on all trading instruments and currencies, including the ruble. The Russian currency resumed its bullish run following a multi-day decline. Higher oil prices slightly eased the pressure on the ruble. Thus, the Russian currency is expected to strengthen up to 17.5 rubles per dollar. Its further movement will depend on oil prices and the upcoming Fed meeting. In general, analysts predict the dollar-ruble pair to trade with a range of 71, 71 and a half rubles. Speaking of gold, the precious metal tumbled while the US currency added in value. Gold's inverse relationship with the dollar shows that market is preparing for the Federal Open Market Committee meeting. Investors are not ready to take risks amid the lack of clarity and the Fed's decision on the timing of its QE program phase-out. Notably, gold is still the main safe haven asset and even with no decisions and significant news, its value may still rise. Currently, gold is trading at $1,786 per ounce and amid the outcome of the Fed meeting, gold prices may advance to $1,790 per ounce. And that was the forecast for the beginning of the trading week. As we can see, market participants are awaiting for the Fed's decision and the main trading instruments are trading mixed. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.